and welcome fans of flip clocks this is an explainer video of sorts as to why i would make a movie trailer type video about a fringe clock uh the movie fringe uh, flip clock well i really did look for that thing for about three years not continuously but i kept my eye open and boy when not that thing showed up i truly i knew exactly what it was when i saw it on ebay but uh i just have a lot of fun with the videos the movie trailer videos when uh it's a clock that really means something to me so I just had a lot of fun with it. Plus, I got to work with the uh, movie trailer guy, uh, the voice uh, from Darren Marlar, who's a great guy to work with. He's real easy to work with. And uh, here's a sample from uh, his uh, movie trailer voice. In a world where a smart aleck, egocentric, self-centered, middle aged Hey, now, hold on. Uh, but from the Fringe trailer, it was like this. Fringe is an American science fiction television series. But anyway, uh, so that's a little explanation. Uh, but anyway, here's the clock in a little more uh, close-up, a little more detail. It's a decent little uh, radio flip clock. Nothing particularly special about it. Uh, the Baycrest model HB23. It is made in Hong Kong, which is uh, not as typical as some of the other clocks that are collectible. So it's kind of unique in that way. And it is from Canada. So um, anyway, it's got uh, t uh, the volume there. You turn it on that way too. There's, and then this is the tuner you can see that uh, in the top you do AM and in the bottom you would uh, tune in FM there's the um, switches for setting the alarm to radio or buzzer and that's the sleep timer over there and it's got a regular knob there for turning the clock I like how they put on there that it's a digital clock in case you didn't notice it's digital and you can see that uh, it's made in Japan the uh, mechanism this is a lot of these clocks and oh look at that this is the way the clock arrived um, I was quite shocked but the face plate is a very thin plastic very flimsy but uh, and it's stuck on there with some uh, with some glue that obviously didn't hold up over the years so we'll have to get that uh, more permanently and there is the whirly gig uh, which is the correct terminology as you all know uh, if you're a member of flip clock fans and yes the correct terminology is whirly gig that's according to flipclockfans.com so shut up and, and like i said it's a decent little flip clock i and uh, the first time i've ever seen it uh on ebay for years so when you get the time come visit us at flipclockfans.com uh, oh i oh i get it oh, that, oh it's a pun when you get the time, come visit us. <laughs>